What up, y'all? Welcome back to Let's Play Ease Origin. How's it going? Sorry it's been so many days. I haven't played this since last Sunday. Today's Friday. <sighs> Man, I'm sorry for the lack of episodes, but today may very well be the finale episode of Unica's Story. We shall see. We're at the top of the tower. Let's see what's going down. It's... it's... that guy. Lady Rhea! Y Unica! Oh, um, what was this guy's voice? It was like, I gave him like the fucking count voice, right? Like, well, if it isn't the Tova girl. Ah, ah, ah. Bitch, please. Hello, Mr. Alucard. Ah, ah, ah. I must admit I'm surprised. I never expected a powerless child like you to be the first one up here. Can the chatter, Dallas? Just release Lady Rhea and hand over the Black Pearl. I'm afraid I can't do that. They're both quite instrumental to my plans, you see. Ah, ah, ah. Your plans? You mean this ritual to make Solomon Shrine fall out of the sky? Why go to so much trouble to do that? What can you possibly gain from it? Oh, come now, isn't it obvious? In order to make the demonic essence whole, I need the full power of the Black Pearl. And right now, most of that power is being used to keep your precious shrine aloft. Therefore, to gain my end, your kind must lose their wings, so to speak. Go oh, wait. So you're doing all this, manning an army of demons, killing innocent people, and causing suffering on a massive scale? Just so you can steal the power we're using to keep our holy shrine afloat? Well, when you put it that way, yes. That's the long and short of it, indeed. You see, only the divine power of the goddesses is capable of controlling the Black Pearl. And since they're not particularly interested in redirecting their efforts, I'm left with but one course of action. You... And everyone who serves you is a monster! Ah, 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 perhaps. But if so, I'm most comfortable in my monstrousness. And now, I must ever so delicately pluck your Lady Rhea's powers from her. Soon the demonic essence will regain its perfect form. Like hell, I won't let you lay a finger on her! Tee up! <laughs> Ugh. You're wasting your time. Remember, you're no sorceress. You're just a little girl blindly flailing around big sharp objects. And I am behind a very solid barrier. Yurika, don't! He's taken the demonic essences into himself. Even with your father's sword, you won't be able to touch him at all. No! Ah, ah. Ah, has it finally dawned on you just how weak you truly are? Perhaps I should give you a proper demonstration of my power, in case any doubt remains. This is what it means to be a Darkling. Darkling? Oh no! Yo, block that shit, girl. Ugh. Oh, damn. God! Unica! It ends here, Unica Tova. You should have known better than to set foot in my circle. Your fate was sealed the moment you appeared before me. I bid you farewell. May the Lex life treat you more favorably. Ah, ah, ah. Ah. Uh. Against all odds, I made it all the way to the tower summit. But now. It's all for nothing. I'm gonna die here. Dad, boy, what do I do? Key up! Someone saved her. You know she ain't gonna die. Is it gonna be Hugo or is it gonna be somebody else? Suck on that, bitch. What? I'm alive? Um, I'm guessing it's the other goddess. Sorry to have kept you waiting, Unica. And... 
Got it. Oh, and it's everybody. Let's go. Reinforcements have arrived, bitch. Mighty impressive that you made it all the way here on your own, though. You, you came. Fuck yeah. If you'd please, Rhea, we must gather our power and convert it upon Unica. Of course, on your lead, Fina. Here it comes. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. The divine power of the goddesses. No, it's more than that. But how? Don't doubt yourself, Unica. You've never been, never once been powerless. You've always been strong. All of our wishes, our feelings, and our strengths, we now give to you. Take them with our blessings. Lady Rhea, Lady Fina. My sword is going blue. Hey up! <laughs> hey up! Fuck your barrier, bitch! Let's go. I, I did it? Impossible! Very well, then. I will not allow my aspirations to be compromised by the likes of you. Behold, my true might! He's gonna. What's he gonna turn into? What's he doing? Watch out, Unica! He's releasing the demonic essence within him! He's the he intense to transform! Uh oh. What's he gonna be? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Behold, the perfect fusion of man and demon. May this sight forever burn itself into your eyes. Until I pluck them from your dead body. And? What's he gonna be? He's gonna be something big as fuck, probably. I wonder if this is actually the final boss. I kind of hope that it is. The real question is how hard is it going to be? Yo, he's Final Fantasy as fuck right now. Look at him, dude. The hell am I even looking at? Demon, all right. He's a combination of many weird looking things. But definitely demonic. Let's go. Dallas the Deranged. All right, Dallas. Send you back to motherfucking Texas, baby. Let's go. Get my ass kicked. Let's go. So I haven't played this in Sunday, so you'll have to forgive me if I look like I'm bad at this. This also feels like Form 1, doesn't it? Because I'm already halfway through it. Feels like... Feels like this should... I shouldn't be halfway through this already, you know? Okay. I was... I thought that was me getting hurt. Anyway, I took out Form 1 or whatever. But he got all his health back, so that was just Phase 1. Which is kind of what I expected. Okay, so I can't hurt him with his shield up. So now what? Now we play Shmup games. Okay. It's fun. Did I hit him? Hmm. Oh, maybe I got... Oh, you know what? I bet you I got to hit his little guns. How much one bet? Hit those guns. Get them. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's totally what we got to do. Got to get rid of these guns, dude. Got to get rid of the guns, dude. It may not be his health bar, but if you get rid of those guns, that's got to be what it is. He's protecting those guns on purpose. It's got to be what it is, right? I'm totally disregarding all this shit that's happening to me right now. It's got to be working, right? I, don't, I can't even tell if I'm hitting the damn things, honestly. Whatever. Fucking tornadoes, go away. Those tornadoes do way too much damage. I'm definitely hitting those things. It is happening. Right? I'm not crazy, am I? I'm not being crazy, am I? Okay, maybe I am. So I'm not hitting him at all. I'm not doing any damage. Like, that's discernibly happening. Hmm. Am I supposed to use something? Am I supposed to just beat the shit out of this till it breaks? I don't know. Have some of this shit, bitch. I didn't do anything. Alright, this isn't doing anything. Okay, what am I supposed to do? I'm unclear. Anyway, I'm about to get I'm about to die. Yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm, I'm two health away. Now I'm dead. 
Okay, well, phase one's easy. Second phase, don't know what to do. What other options do I have? I'm just trying to think of, like, what are my other options? I don't know, but we could fuck this guy up with the fireball move. It's crazy strong. Fireball move is where it's at, baby. Charge it up, charge it up, charge it up. Woo! Look at that damage, though. I think it was smart to go to level 50 for this fight. I'm really glad I grinded for that la at the end of last episode. That's making this a little bit easier, baby. All right, phase two, inbound. All right, what do we do here? What do we do? What do I do? What options do I have? I can switch weapons. I feel like that's not doing anything, though. Okay, what about this one? Wait. What is that red bar that just popped up? Do you see that? There's a red bar. What's that red bar? Oh, my... I'm actually damaging the shield? Wait. What am I damaging? I don't know what I'm damaging, but it's doing something. Whatever, dude. I'm just gonna keep doing it. It's doing something. As soon as I break that open. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Now we're in there. Yo, let's go. Let's go, baby. Oh, yeah. Unleash the beast. Oh, man. It broke. It broke open. Oh, I get it. Depending on what color the shield is, I can only break it with that weapon. Okay. I think I get it. So I'm guessing the, the, the fire one will work here. Oh, yeah. No? Oh, yeah. It has to... Oh, it actually has to be the element itself. Oh, okay. Okay. I finally get it. You have to actually use the element itself. I get it. I'm just spamming like a motherfucker right now. I shouldn't have done that, but whatever. All right, now it looks yellow, so... Yep. Okay. I understand this fight now. I'm kind of YOLOing, YOLOing the hell out of it, but it's fine. There's probably another phase after this one. I'm just trying to jump more so I avoid more of the damage, but... Whatever, right now I'm YOLOing. I should be charging these attacks up instead of spamming them. Alright. Just fucking use it, dude. Got him! Phase 3, here we go. What you got now, bitch? Now, okay, now do I attack these fucking things? I, I can hit them now. So that's probably a good sign. Uh. I gotta pay attention to that boost thing. Dude, that boost thing is where it's at. Also, ah. Uh... Oh, I wanna. Oh my god, I can't see. What is he doing? What is this? Oh, hell no. What? Oh, this is bullshit. Oh, that's horse shit. Oh, that's horse shit. Dude, he didn't even have both the guns. What the fuck? He didn't even have both. Oh my god. How is this fair? That's not fair. That is totes unfair, dude. Hella unfair, dude. Hella unfair. What the fuck? What the actual fuck? What a fucking cheater, dude. What a fucking cheap ass motherfucker. I don't appreciate your cheap skating, bro. Sorry, at least I don't understand phase two. We can get started like right away. Let's switch to the correct element and let's go. Watch out. At least I understand what to do now. So now we're in extreme focus. Final boss, awesome music mode. Let's go. Alright, just fucking just, just thwack away, dude. Just thwack the fuck away right now. I don't even care. No reason to switch weapons, just thwack away. Alright, get your element shit back, bro. Get it all back, get it all back, get it all back. Just to have you. Get it all back, get it all back. Alright, all right, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We're cool. Just spam that shit. Alright. Go! That's fine, it's fine. Just fucking thwack, just thwack, just thwack, just thwack. Let's go. Whack, 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 so hard. Whack, whack. Okay. We're good. Alright, charge it up, charge it up. Hey, yo, DJ, charge that shit. 
Just trying to conserve as much health as possible here. Alright, here we go. Finish him. Finish him. Fucking boost that shit, bitch. Did I boost it? I think I did. Oh, I fucking... Oh, oh no, we're in last phase. Never mind. We're good. thought I wasn't in the last phase. I was like, what the heck? Better be in the last phase. Alright, I, I got rid of one already. Here with this other one. Alright, I got rid of this shit already. Let's go. Spam that shit, dude. Spam it! Alright, that's fine. Okay, so that's how this is gonna work. So we just have to, like, keep clearing his fucking body bodyguards out as quickly as possible. Alright, got the boot. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, oh okay, that's actually fine. I didn't actually mean to do that. What the fuck? What? I was in the middle of invincibility move and that happens? What the fuck? That's whore garbage. Whore garbage, I say. Only whore garbage. That's some whore, that's some whore, whore ass whoreness. still boosted right now, dude. Come on, baby. Kill off one of these at least. Nope, 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 no, 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 no. I'm out of there. Fuck you. Fuck you in your face. Nope. Nope. My boost is already charged up again, too. Let's go. Let's go, dude, for the win. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes! Oh, that better be it. Three phase for the victory. Let's go. Let's go. God, that music was badass, too. Didn't have time to rock on it, though. I had to fucking move quick and action it up. Is that it, though? Did I just beat the game? I might have been a quick finale ep episode. Uh, uh, uh. So it comes to this, my ambitions foiled by worthless, pathetic, powerless humans. You're wrong about us, Dallas. We may be weaker than you'd like, but we're not powerless by any means. Our weaknesses are what make us strong. They bring us together and help us complement one another with our individual strengths. And by working together, there's nothing we can't do. Ah, 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 such trite naivete. But I suppose you did defeat me with it. Just remember, humans and demons are like two sides of the same coin. Demons were born in the shadows of ease's prosperity, after all. As long as humans desire that which remains out of reach, the demonic essence will never die. Our kind feeds off of yours. We will always return. So it shall ever be for all eternity, inescapably. Ah, 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 <laughs> Face plant. <laughs> Love it. I'm guessing that means he's dead. Ah! Yurika, please stand back. What you see before you is the demonic essence itself. Uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> but what are you going to do with it? You just leave that to us. Fina, are you ready? I am. Here they go. What are they going to do? What are you going to do? Oh, they're going to play the song. Duh. I'm just going to play a little ditty.
actual rendered cutscene. Nah, I've had a few of them, but that one actually showed some demons and shit. That's right, get your hands off my sanctuary. Tentacles. <laughs> nice. Epic fucking music, too. Holy shit. Love it. Well then, the world is saved, now what? Hey, look at that view though, nice. Doesn't look very black pearly to me anymore. What? But I was really hoping we would all go back to the shrine, together. Why do you have to stay on the surface? Yurnika. We gave up our wings to seal away the demonic- Oh, right. Their wings are gone. Whoa, dude. Okay. And the goddess's wings aren't just a symbol of her power, but a vessel for her life's energy. Without them, our time is short. We're going to sleep soon. Like, likely for a very, very long time. You're going to sleep? I'm afraid so. And there's something we're going to need you to do for us. The seal we've placed on the demonic essence has been perfect at best. Returning the Black Pearl to Solomon's Shrine would be far too dangerous. Even keeping it here would be inviting calamity. Once we've drifted to sleep, both we and the Pearl must be entombed deep within the earth, far from human hands. Y you mean, we're never gonna see you again? You may. You may. We will reawaken some again someday. And when I do, I promise you'll be the first person we seek out. You don't know when that'll be, or if I'll still be even all stewing around. I lost Dad, and I lost Roy, and now I'll be losing you too. I... I'm sorry, Unica. Please don't cry. We understand your request, and we shall grant it. You may count on us, both in this and in all future affairs of state, while you sleep. Thank you, Father Shion. When you return to the shrine, please tell the priest what has transpired here and give them our fondest regards. Man, I don't envy that task one bit. Breaking news like this to the six priests won't be easy. Indeed, this will be a day remembered solemnly forevermore. Lady Rhea, Lady Fina, may I ask one final question? Dallas claimed that the demons would never be gone for good, as long as we live. My first instinct was to dismiss that as an empty threat from a dying man. But on further consideration, I'm forced to wonder. He spoke the truth, I'm afraid. The demons are gone for now, but they will return one day. When that will be, and what form they'll take, however, remains a mystery. I see. Should we prepare for that contingency, then? I don't think you'll need to. I have no doubt that when it, when and if it happens, ease will prevail. And we'll be there to ma help make sure of it. Ah, oh, okay. They'll be back. It's time, Fina. Lady Rhea, Lady Fina! Such a sour face. Come on, Unica. At least see us off with a smile. There's a lot for you to be happy about, after all. You've found your own inner strength, and shown bravery beyond the need for magic. We can't thank you enough for everything you've done. You've always been dear to us, Unica. A true friend in every way. Please, promise us that even when, as you, we sleep, you'll always remember us fondly. You'll always think of us as friends, no matter what. Lady Rhea, Lady Fina... Of course! How could I ever think of you as anything but? Well then... Goodbye! 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 I'll miss you! you, you. Are they gonna really fall asleep like that? Oh my lord. 
hugging the pearl. Good lord. And so the crisis that had brought the land of ease to the brink of annihilation was finally resolved, albeit impermanently. Unica and the others enshrined the goddesses in the Black Pearl deep underground, just as promised. Afterward, they began preparing to use their remaining magical energy for a return trip to Solomon's Shrine in the Heavens. Okay. Oh, do we get to go say goodbye to the tree real quick? I guess so. Goodbye, tree friend that we met at the beginning and never talked to again. Till now. So you're going to sleep too, huh? Guess it'll be getting pretty lonely down here. When the goddess is awakened once more, then so too shall we. But until such time, I beg thee, bid me respite. Of course. Sleep well, Rhoda. Farewell, daughter of Tova. Farewell, youths of ease. Is everyone prepared? What? We're leaving already? Yes, since the tower fell silent, Solomon's Shrine has again begun to rise. The farther it distances itself from the surface, the more difficult it will be to mount maintain transport. Our window of opportunity is small. I too hate the pot. To part with this land, but the fact remains, our place is in the shrine. There is nothing left for us here. You may proceed, Father Shion. Shion. Thank you. Dino, Eolia, if you'd please. Yes, Father. Right away. The teleport spell, if you will. Okay. Well, guys, we get one more cutscene here, or what? Please, gather within the tribe will be formed. Do as you did when we first came here. The procedure is largely the same. Okay. Wait. Twat. Unica? Well, what's wrong? Oh, boy. I think I know where this is going. Well, um... We've been talking it over, and we've decided to stay here. What? What? <laughs> Are you serious? I just... I hate to think of the goddesses being left down in that dark, dingy tomb all alone and unprotected. I want to stay close to them and watch over them to make sure nobody disturbs the rest. I feel like I was abandoning them, abandoning them otherwise. That's a noble sentiment, but... Have you really thought this through? I mean, once we're gone, you may very well never see us again. This is your one and only chance to go home. Technically, this is just as much our home as, as Solomon's Shrine. It's not only the goddesses we'd be abandoning if we left it. Ys has been thoroughly ravaged by the demons, and someone needs to take care of the first steps towards recultivating the land. So we're gonna fuck until we have millions of children and repopulate the earth. I mean, I didn't say that part out loud, did I? Whoops. Whoa, I just realized this song's got a nice little kick to it. Okay. 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 Listen to that. Uh, 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 uh. Listen to that. Listen to that. Uh, 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 uh. Let's go. Uh, that beat, though. Anyway, yeah, you and I are completely behind Hugo on that. And Pugo's gonna be behind me. I mean, someday Solomon Shrine will find its way back to the surface. And when it does, we want to be here to meet it, meet you, and we want East to be as beautiful as it was back when we were little kids. We're going to make this barren land shine again. After all, this is ease. Our ease. Well, I guess you really have thought it through. I don't think I've ever heard you four sound more determined. Seems we all have our parts to play. We're just on different stages. I hope our absence doesn't cause any undue difficulty for you. It's times like this that I miss being a headstrong young man. Unikatova, holy knight of ease, I have one final order for you before we depart. Sir? Watch over the goddesses on our behalf. We'll be much too far away to watch over them ourselves, after all. Yes, sir. Won't be easy down here, you know. Hope you're ready for some hardships. I will personally deliver the news of this decision to your families and loved ones, if I may. Thank you, Cecilia. That would be great. And don't worry, Ramona. We're ready for this. I don't know how I could ever repay you all for everything you've done. I'll miss you, and I'll never forget you. Come. Our time is short. Don't you know, Aeolia? We must begin the spell. Yes, yes, father. Understood. Goodbye, bye. Well, I kind of could have guessed that. I wasn't expecting the other two kids to stay with us, though. I, I had a feeling Unica 
and and Hugo were gonna stay, but I didn't know the other two younger dudes were gonna stay too. Interesting. Well then, they're off, and we're staying. Okay. Probably a good thing I beat the boss fast, because now this is you know there's all this ending stuff that's taking up time. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. I don't know why the island is falling apart. That's not good, is it? I don't know, man. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. E's origin! I guess that's it. Credit roll. Are we done? Are we done? Development members. Yep, that's it. Okay, guys. Whoo! E's origin. Done. Now... I say that, obviously I mentioned earlier, this is just Unica's story, and we knew that from when we started off the game. I knew that going into this game when I started up the game in the very beginning before I even started playing. People told me there were three stories, and I do intend on playing all three stories. So for those of you watching this right now, worried that I'm not going to do more, don't worry. I'm going to play the rest of the game. I'm going to play the whole Hugo story, and then whatever the third guy is, or girl, I think it's a guy, it looks like a guy on the, in the screen, even though it was like faded out, it still looked like a dude. I don't know who it is. I'm wondering who it is. Uh, I don't know if it unlocks until you play Hugo's story. I kind of hope it doesn't. That way I am definitely not going to get spoiled on who it might be before I play Hugo's story. But anyway, the one thing about the uh, other playthrough, though, it was playing as Hugo, is I'm pretty sure it's almost identical to the playthrough we just did, except for some story bits, obviously. All the story bits will probably be different because it's Hugo's side of everything that happened. And then, obviously, the other big thing is we never fought Dante, so I'm assuming Hugo is going to have a separate boss fight. And I'm going to guess that instead of Kishgal, I'm going to fight Dante there. Like, Unica killed Kishgal, so Hugo is going to kill Dante. That's my guess. If that's not the case, then that's cool too. And if there's other different boss fights too, even better. Um, but yeah, obviously, we're just basically going to have to replay the game with different cutscenes and... Uh, you know, going through areas we've already been. But the game's fast-paced enough, and it didn't really take me that long to where I feel like we'll probably get through it a slight bit faster. I'll probably do a little bit more grinding off-screen and probably just try to fly through the areas faster. Um, again, if all the items are the same, like, in the same locations for the most part, then I'm not even going to worry about showing, like, anything. I'll probably, I might just make, like, an abridged fucking series. Who knows? Like, just sit down and record this for a few hours and then just abridge it down to the story parts that matter. I may do that, I may not do that, I probably just won't do that, depending on time. But my main concern is September's almost over, and I haven't even started on the second person's story. So you guys are probably like, well, you're not going to finish this before October. And I'll just tell you now, I'm probably not, and that probably means at some point, unless I actually do the bridge version I just said, we may have to take a break in the middle of this series, which I hate to do. But really, this game isn't that hard to get into, so it shouldn't be that hard to jump right back into. If I could somehow, again, record a bunch of this all at once and maybe possibly finish up Hugo's story really fast and then just like make videos out of it, that'd be pretty nice. I'll see what I can do though. Again, I'm pretty busy these days, so I'm not going to have a ton of time to like between now and October and then when October begins, I'll, I'm only going to be more busy. So videos are going to be interesting. I don't even know what I'm, how my schedule is going to end up and how I'm going to fit in all the shit I want to do in October. But either way, I do intend on starting up Hugo's story as quickly as possible. So, um, yeah, so that's this is only the Unica finale, guys. To be continued, indeed. The LP ain't over. Even if the episode says Unica finale, which it probably does. Dude, we got hella Chivos just for beating the game, though. Just for beating the game, though. Wow, that's like five Chivos. Wow. Okay. Any more? Would you like to give me more Chivos game? No? All right, Unica can now be used in time attack mode. After selecting time attack on the tile screen, you may select your character and difficulty level. Toll can now be used in story mode. Who is Toll? He will appear in the character select screen. Oh. Well, I guess we know who the third person is. Well, name, but we don't know who that is. So we never heard the name Toll before. So that doesn't really give me anything away, which is nice. Um, better not give anything away in the fucking comments, you bastards. You've been pretty good about it this game. Not story heavy, so not a lot of people speculating and talking about story stuff in the comments. That's nice. All right, anyway, that's it for today's episode. It's kind of a shorter one, but 
That's what happens when I'm re literally right before the final boss and I beat him in two tries or three tries or whatever that was. Uh, anyway, I'm very much enjoying this playthrough, so I'm actually kind of excited to get on to the next story. Again, I'm probably going to try and fly through it as, ha as hard and fast as possible. I'll try to make it a little more streamlined, whether it be from editing or actually just flying through the story myself faster. We'll see how it goes. Uh, I, again, I'm going to start it up, and again, there might be a break in the middle of Hugo, or I'll record the whole thing as quickly as possible and split it into videos just based on what time. But I'm thinking no matter what, this episodes will definitely bleed into October, or I'll break them and we'll finish it after October. Either way, it'll get done. We will finish it, and it won't take us that long. Even if the third story, uh, which I have no idea where that one goes. For all I know, we're climbing the same tower a third time. I have no idea. Uh... Anyway, I'm going to stop babbling now because this is just another episode and, a little episode and an LP we're only really a third of the way done with. So hope you guys are hyped for some more of this because it is enjoyable and the music is just it's too kick-ass to not be excited to get, continue on with. All right, enough babbling. I'll see you guys in the next one. Hugo Inbound. See you guys then. Peace!